Welcome back, everybody, to our grand opening special of Super Nintendo World, in which we're going to play another NES game, and it's going to be Jeopardy. Let's see how we do. I'm ready to play, and I'm ready to win. Yeah, we'll be him. This is our fourth specialist here. We have Irene and Jean facing me today. British English 100. British chips are the equivalent of this U.S. junk food. What are French fries? British English for 200, please. The name of an American cereal, it means so long in England. What is Cheerio? British English for 300. British babies don't take a nappy, they wear one. What is a diaper? British English for 400. One status if he is sent down from Oxford. What is expelled? British English 500, please. Order a banger in England and you'll get this. What is a sausage? Ran the category with $1,500. Dog on TV 100. This collie was the first animal named Animal Hall of Fame. Who was Lassie? Uh, dogs on TV for 200, please. On TV, this beautiful German Shepherd was Rusty's faithful companion. Who is Rin Tin Tin? Dogs on TV for 300, please. The little rascal's dog with the ring around his eye. Who is Petey? Did I spell his name right? I did. They took it. I'll take dogs on TV for 400. This large TV family had a shaggy sheep dog named Tiger. Who are the, what are the Brady Bunch? Dogs on TV 500. This talking basset hound expressed herself on the classic series The People's Choice. Uh, don't know. Uh. Okay. Who is Cleo? That's right. Egypt 100. The Suez Canal lakes the Gulf of Suez in this sea. What is the Mediterranean? Uh, Egypt for 200. In ancient Egypt, this word meant ruler. What is Pharaoh? Egypt 300. I'll bet it all, why not? The Aswan Dam spans this river. What is the Nile? Egypt for 400. Located at Giza, it has the head of a human and the body of a lion. What is the Sphinx? Egypt for 500. Gave up the throne of Egypt in 1952. King Farouk? Oh, yeah. Too late, though. That's okay. Go get the next one. Publishing 200. John Werner founded this music magazine whose title sounds like a rock group. Uh, what is Rolling Stone? I'll 
take publishing for a hundred. This feminist fatale helped found the women's magazine, Miz. Who's Gloria Steinem? I'll take publishing for 300. Burt Reynolds' centerfold in this magazine was a sellout. What is... Cosmopolitan? Publishing for 400. His funeral services were piped into the Time and Life building. Henry the... Henry Luce. Okay. Again, new not. Australian publishing magnet whose New York Post features lurid headlines. I'm gonna say who's Rupert Murdoch. Pure Evil 100. Mr. Hyde's alter ego. Who is Dr. Jekyll? Pure Evil for 200. He knows what evil lurks in the hearts of men. What is a shadow? Uh, pure evil for 300, please. He's the villain of Genesis chapter 3, verse 13. Wrong. What is a serpent? I'll take pure evil for 400. Villain created by Sax Romer, he personified the stereotype of yellow peril. Wrong. I'm not gonna try. <clears throat> Doctor... Oh, Doctor Fu Manchu! Oh, okay. Let's keep going. The dynamic duo, who are Batman and Robin. A round robin for 200. This comedian shows his acting and linguistic prowess in Moscow on the Hudson. Who is Robin Williams? Round Robin 300. U.S. colonists named this variety after a European bird with a much redder chest. What is the red breasted robin? Or the robin redbreast? Try robin redbreast. Uh oh. That is right. A uh, round robin for 400, please. Hey, Nolan son, he's the subject of Winnie the Pooh. Who is Christopher Robin? That's correct. Uh, round robin for 500, please. Born Robert Fitzsuit in 1160, he was out the outlawed Earl of Huntington. Uh, who is Robin Hood? Right, not the last clue. This incestuous son of King Arthur brought about the fall of Camelot. And his name is Mordred. 
So at the end of the Jeopardy round, I have $10,200. Jean, 1300 Irene, minus 1200 So she's gonna go first. Famous structure is 200. <clears throat> she's 151 feet from sandals to torch. What is the Statue of Liberty? Famous structures for 400. Renowned as India's loveliest building, it is actually a white marble tomb. What is the Taj Mahal? Uh, famous structures for 600, please. The structure separating east and west was erected overnight, August of 1961. What is the Berlin Wall? Famous structures for uh, 800, please. The only man made structure visible from orbiting spacecraft. What is the. What is the Gemini? No, that's wrong. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, hold on. <clears throat> oh, wait a minute, I figured it out. I misunderstood the clue. Let's see if Gene can get this. Yeah, yeah, it just dawned on me, but too late. It's okay, check it off, check it off. Check it off. It's the Great Wall of China. Yeah. Famous structures, 1,000. This tunnel through the Alps connects France and Italy. Not gonna try. Oh, it's the Mont Blanc tunnel. Mont Blanc, yeah. That makes sense. Let's keep going. Solid Jackson, okay. Diana Ross discovered this numerically named family singing group for the Jackson 5. I'll take a uh, solid Jackson for 400. Jackson is the capital and largest city of the southern state. What is Mississippi? Uh, Missis uh, solid Jackson for 600, please. Shoeless Joe Jackson was involved in this sport's greatest scandal. What is baseball? I'll take Solid Jackson for 800. How Thomas Jonathan Jackson was known after his first stand at Bull Run. What? Who is Stonewall Jackson? Uh, Solid Jackson for 1,000. <laughs> Gospel singer who trained herself in Baptist choirs of Louisiana. Mahalia Jackson? Try it. Good thing I buzzed in. Um, let me have uh, for, uh, flowers for 200. It's the flower associated with Pasadena and New Year's Day. What is the rose? Flowers for 400. The source of opium. What is the poppy? Flower 600. This flower's root is roasted as a poppy substitute. What is chicory? All right, flowers 800. This weed is good for salads, wine, medicine, and a coffee substitute. 
Uh, what is the dandelion? Flower is 1,000. Florida State Flower. It is used as a symbol of good luck in bridal bouquets. Oh, the orange blossom. That makes sense, because, you know, Florida's the orange state. Best known for all sorts of orange things. Anyways. In France, it's parapluie. In British slang, a brawly. What is an umbrella? Uh, four phrases for 400. This German word expresses a passion for traveling. Wanderlust. Oh, yeah. In Italian, this name in a low voice... This means in a low voice or under one's breath. Sala Bocci. Oh, yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Let's keep going. This president was criticized for trying to pack the Supreme Court. Oh, Franklin Delano Roosevelt. Irene finally gets a clue right. How about that? Old Hickory. He was the only president to publicly threaten to hang the vice president. Um, who was Theodore Roosevelt? Not Theodore Roosevelt. Oh well. Got a lot of money sitting in front of me. Oh, it's Andrew Jackson. Alright. He asked children, won't you be my neighbor? Who is Mr. Rogers? TV for 400. I see nothing, I hear nothing was a standard cop out on Hogan's Heroes. Who was Newkirk? No. Sergeant Schultz. Okay. This astronaut won twenty-five thousand on Name That Tune. Who is John Glenn? Uh, TV for eight hundred, please. I'll do forty-four hundred. This fictitious newspaper employed Lou Grant. What is the Los Angeles Tribune? All right. Uh, TV for 1,000, please. Mary Richards worked for this TV station. Try. I'll say what is WJMTV. That's correct. Lucky guess, too. Um, let's have four phrases for 800. 4,000. A Russian carriage drawn by three horses abreast. What is a troika? Wow! Guess on that one as well, I got $25,000. The meaning of Tonto's Kimosabi. Faithful 
friend. Okay. That's right. We have three clues left. Gene, which one do you want? His televised press conferences were called the best matinee in town. Who was Dwight Eisenhower? No, that's not correct. But with all the money I have sitting in front of me, I'm not going to complain. John F. Kennedy. This president also served as Chief Justice. Who is William Howard Taft? That's right, now the last clue. He said, can't stand the heat, get out of the kitchen. Who is Harry Truman? That is right, so I have $26,400, Gene has $3,900, and Irene, you're going home. Let's play Final Jeopardy with the category of art. I'm just going to do 1400 in case I get it wrong. $1,980? Okay. Here comes the clue in art. Final Jeopardy. Art protest movement of movements of European 20s. Its name means hobby course and sounds like baby talk. That's my answer. Judaism. Or it's just da-da. Will they take my answer or will they not take it? They're going to take it. 27,800. And I'll see you all for the next segment.